Today I want to talk about what is the best method to get skin fairness. People have heard of so many different techniques and they wonder what's the best method. And here's a Sri Lankan patient I have treated in the past with my special treatment and we achieved a fair amount of fairness as well as anti-aging effect and removal of pigmentation. And these are the treatments I'm going to discuss today. Here's another patient who had actually lost weight also achieved a very beautiful skin color following the treatment. Now we have all heard about glutathione injections. I'm the first doctor who brought glutathione injections to Sri Lanka and made it famous. And it's sure it works to get skin fairness but there are some problems associated with it and a lot of doctors and other people who are giving injections don't tell their clients about this. So I decided to produce this lecture and gluten injections are now banned in two countries one Philippine and another country due to very serious side effects people had died due to very serious skin in allergies called Steven Johnson syndrome and it has also caused serious liver and kidney problems also as you continue the injections it has feedback mechanisms that means it uh, makes your skin, uh, skin cells and all the other cells produce less and less glutathione as the intracellular glutathione production becomes less and less, the skin whitening effect gets less and less as well. And with the new techniques, we don't have that problem, we don't have the side effects, and we use 10 different antioxidants and vitamins which help to produce intracellular glutathione. And we also have seen that the new technique not only has continuous effect unlike the injection does not have any serious side effects it also helps some patients helps helped a lot of patients already to cure their diabetes high blood pressure and arthritis as well as some people have corrected their uh, heart problems as well and I've seen a few people who have got complete relief from fatty liver rheumatoid arthritis with this treatment and because these treatments also help to remove uh, toxins which come from bad diet. Uh, it also helps with mental health and memory. Oshamis is one of the conditions which we find commonly in Sri Lanka today, commoner than before. And in America, they say every one out of ten people will get Oshamis uh, once they uh, come to the age of 65 years. And we can prevent this by following a good diet as well as this new antioxidant treatments. We can also cure the early stage Alzheimer's and prevent it from progressing to the serious late stages. With this new skin whitening treatment, we use the day cream, which should be applied two times a day, and an eye cream, usually to be applied half an hour before you go to sleep. We also recommend our patients to avoid direct exposure to sunlight it's important to know that even a Caucasian person go, who goes in the sun after a while gets very dark. So once you get fair, it's very important to avoid the direct sunlight exposure. It works better for younger patients who are in 20s and 30s. Even when you're pregnant or you're breastfeeding, you can use this because these are all natural treatments. And actually it's good for the baby or the fetus. When you take this, you can improve the health of the fetus as well as the little baby who is getting breastfed and if you have sun damage or you have chronic medical problems you need longer treatment otherwise a few months of treatment is enough if you have acne and other skin problems they also get cured with the same program and people especially the people who have acne and acne marks should be following a good diet you want to avoid the sugar any kind of sugar, dairy foods, meat and processed foods as well as you want to avoid taking a lot of carbohydrates such as rice, bread, flour products and wheat products. And here's another patient who has used our treatment for anti-aging and a fairness effect. The diet I'm recommending is a diet high in protein but low in carbohydrates. So we recommend increased amounts of legumes such as garbanzos, cowpea and dal, high amounts of vegetables, 
as well as fruits with less low sugar because fruits have a lot of antioxidants and and we have very special diet which is made especially for people who want to cure their diabetes or high blood pressure the special diet is uh, con consists of taking three soups daily for breakfast lunch and dinner until the weight is corrected and the disease is cured you have to avoid the rice bread and other wheat products and you make the soup out of these vegetables usually onions cabbage green beans mushrooms tomatoes and maybe kangkung or one kind of green vegetable or you can also replace the uh, green beans with uh, garbanzo beans, kadala, mung, cowpea, anything which is in the legume family. And usually these legumes should be soaked in water for at least 24 to 48 hours before you boil them because that way you can avoid getting the anti-nutrients and you can increase the nutritional value of these products. And don't add any kind of oil, no sugar or any kind of beverages. Avoid the fruits with high amount of sugar such as bananas, mangoes, pineapples, dates and dried foods. And you should not take in animal proteins because they contain toxins and hormones. And no chicken or eggs. Between meals, it's good to take some nuts as snacks. Especially almonds, pistachios, peanuts are the best. And the best fruits are the ones with high antioxidants such as pomegranates, berries, mangosteens. And this program is very good for weight loss and we see that the weight gain uh, weight gaining and obesity is very common in Sri Lanka these days and in many countries and here's a practical method to make that diet which you can read in detail once you get our program usually we recommend the treatment we continue for three to four months and after that you can use our creams for another three months and once in a while you can repeat the program to get continuous improvement and you can call us during weekdays for more details. Thank you.